Hey friends, what's up with you? It's your girl, me, Random Kim. And no, it's been a long awaited video. Um, I've been absent for a while, but I'm back. So, I'm just this damn camera. So, if the video looks a little meh, it's because I'm using my, um, my laptop. Because I don't feel like going upstairs dealing with um, plugging up and all that. I don't feel like walking upstairs. I'm lazy these days. So, I've been gone from YouTube. I've been tired. I haven't been feeling well. I've been sick. And all those things lead up to what? I'm pregnant. <laughs> Yay me. Um, Wasn't planned at all. Uh, just going to happen. So, hey. I'm happy and thrilled to become a mommy again. Um, I'm going to answer a few questions. Well, just talk about a topic that I haven't discussed yet um, about BBLs. I get asked a lot via my Facebook and my Oh, I'm sorry. Via my Facebook and my Instagram, I still interact with ladies on a daily. So, um, people always ask, can they sit on their BBL after surgery? Hell yeah, you can sit on it. I mean, when you wake up after surgery, are you not laying down? Yes, you are. So, um, you can sit on your ass. Sit on it. Does not affect your ass at all and um i'm always so tired yo like this pregnancy is draining the shit out of me and i'm always tired i've gained weight i'm five months pregnant now and um i still haven't gotten my energy and stuff back when will i shit i don't know i'm hoping being any day now, but that ain't happened yet. So, um, I have a Periscope. I want y'all to add me on Periscope because I do a lot of live talking to ladies about stuff. And you can all, I mean, if you see my videos and you want to talk to me or you want you have anything you want to ask me, Please hit me up on my Instagram or my Facebook. Like, I'm always on that. Like, for real. Like, that's my holy grail. Um, and I'm on Periscope quite often. So, if you hop on Periscope and I'm live and you type in a question, you ask me a question, I'm going to answer to you live. And I'm also having a gender reveal party on um, Periscope the first Friday in December. Um, yeah, um, listen, I want to talk about surgery journeys because I get a lot of ladies inboxing me about how they're afraid to, after seeing someone else's, um, journey and their journey was difficult, um, their recovery stuff was difficult. Listen, you are an individual person. Not everyone heals at the same rate. No one person is going to have the same exact journey. Do not scare yourself or psych yourself out because someone's posting that they're having a rough time with their journey. Everyone heals differently. I never had complications. Um... After my BBL and lipo. I did have a little bit of. My back. Sorry y'all. I did have a little bit of complications. After my time was up. Which my navel lost oxygen. And um. A stitch. A hidden stitch. Is it called a hidden stitch? And um. It didn't. Uh, it opened a little hole. But which was easily cured. With some antibiotics. And some um. Intercept, antiseptics. So, uh, it was not a big, big deal. But, um, everyone, I never had any 
anything other than that. I removed my own drain by myself. It wasn't hard. It wasn't painful. You just feel tugging because the little holes in the drain is the, the sucking. And it might retract a little bit once you're pulling it. But keep pulling it. It'll pull out. Um, I never, I never had any complications at all. But that's not to say that the next person is not going to have any complications. You may have, you know, your skin might not take too well. You may have to go into the oxygen chamber, which, by the way, is $300 per treatment. Just take extra cash on that what if tip. You know, always be prepared, you know, for things like that. You might need um, a couple of iron treatments, and those are like $50 a piece, if I'm not mistaken. I think they're fifty dollars a piece. They're not thirty to fifty. Um, be prepared for that. You know what I mean. You might be offered to buy a faha while you're there, which is another hundred dollars, hundred thirty, I think. But I always bought my own. So, um, yeah. And um, what else should you prepare for? Um, you might want to get a facial. They offer those. I always have your $250 for your massages. Those are super fucking important. Massages are super duper important. The fuckers hurt. Okay. When they're massaging your swollen ass back in your... Oh. It's not the best feeling in the world. But they are super duper important. For real. So now I'm going to get my pregnant ass up and show you my belly bump at five months. Which I just started to peak a little bit prior to last week i was like super fucking flat you know my husband's a dj my husband is a dj so i was like still going to you know functions with him well i just sat my ass down where i did a dance to my husband um i was still wearing my same clothes my party clothes like i was still like flat and wham bam cut to the coca cola body honey I was still that girl, okay? Last week, I started, my son started doing a little peeky boo, you know, saying, hey, girl, I'm in here. You know what I'm saying? Sit your ass down. So, I listened. Y'all know it's Friday night, and I'm in the house, not doing shit, but talking to y'all. Okay. Y'all better add me a periscope. Just try. I be doing stupid shit like this all the time because I don't do shit but stay home. Bored. Pregnancy. It pause your life. Pause. Anywho, let me stand up and show y'all this bump and um my BBL. Honey, I sat on this ass from day one and I slept on it. I sat on it on the plane. I drove my car and I sat on it and it didn't affect my ass. So here we go. Alright. So here is my baby bump. Five months, y'all. This is the side view. My five month baby bump. Front view of my baby. Five months, y'all. What y'all think? This is five months. I look pregnant, don't I? Let's side again. Y'all look pregnant, y'all. It was flat as a pancake. Now I got like a little, you know, situation going on. And here is my BBL. I'm going to take a step, tip it a little bit. My booty is big. I never, oh, hold on my booty, hold on y'all. <laughs> I never saw, I never, um, you see that ass, y'all. I never, um, not sat on it. Like, I always sat on it. And, um, let me put a damn camera down some. Oh, yeah. I always sat on it. I ain't never not sat on it. And it sit up. Got a dip in it. You see the dip? It go like, from here and it go down. Yeah, I love my BBL. And that's Dr. Medina, girl. So, 
Oh, I'm still hot though, y'all. Look. I see that shit. I'm still sexy and everything. Ooh, girl. <laughs> anyway. Um. Yeah, y'all. And my, my waist still small. Y'all see that shit? Pregnant. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um. Anyway. You get this crazy behavior for me when I'm bored. So y'all better have no periscope. <laughs> and um my gender reveal the first Friday of December. Because I don't know what the hell I'm having. And now y'all know I got all boys. All boys. <sighs> no girls. So hopefully it's a she in Dell. Y'all like this shirt. It said, don't be basic. Girl. I can't even damn breathe. This damn pregnancy, I swear to God. Y'all know what? I'm halfway through it, though. Yes, I am. And I'll be back. Well, I started. But I am going back to Dr. Nina to get a breast lift with implants. Because I'm going to breastfeed this baby. And I already wanted to get a breast lift. So um, I'm going to get a breast lift with implants. Um, lipo to my arms. And maybe some chin lipo. I don't know if I need it or not. But. My chin. Y'all think I need lipo my chin? What y'all think? <laughs> All right, y'all. I heard y'all for watching. I'm going to put the num my shit, my Periscope name in the description box along with my Facebook name. I think I'll put the face, my Facebook link because a lot of people say they can't find me on Facebook. So I think I'll put the link to my Facebook page and I'll put the name for my Instagram and my Periscope name. And if you watch my videos, honey, you want to get in contact with me, girl. That's where I'm at. I'm guaranteed to talk to you on that day. So, until then, I'll hurt you, ladies. I love y'all. I'll see you guys soon. And, um, I'll be back with another update. I'm probably going to be still using my laptop and maybe my cell phone because I'm lazy. I don't feel like climbing a flight of stairs to get to my diva room and do a video to talk to y'all. Not saying y'all not worth it. I'm just saying my ass is lazy. I'm being honest. Alright, so see y'all later. Turn up for me if y'all like it's Friday night. Take a shot for my pregnant bored ass. Bye ladies. <laughs>